Hey, what's going on YouTube? JGMO TV HD out here with the Nintendo Switch. Um, yeah, we out here on this Blaze Blue Cross Tiger Battle. Um, I ain't really played Blaze Blue before, but I've seen like, you know, my friends that are about this fighting game lifestyle, they've been banging out some Blaze Blue back in the day. And um, yeah, I thought I'd try this, see what's really going on because, you know, I don't really have a lot of fighters on the Nintendo Switch. And I was having a look at the gameplay. I was like, yeah, this looks all right. Um, I feel like the other Blaze Blues, they looked a bit mad. Like they look, okay, this is dirty. Hold on, it's very annoying me. All right, there we go. We're back, we're back, we're back. So yeah, here we go, Blaze Blue. Um, I'm gonna skip that intro thing. We're gonna just go straight into the beef. Okay, so this is what the menu looks like. Um, so yeah, that's me. And you can actually use the right analog stick to move the camera around as well. So your little avatar, 3D thing, 3D menu. It's a bit too much for me to be honest, but um, I'll play episode mode, cool. Um, I'd rather just go into, like there must be like a sparring place. I think it's over. No, it's not over there. That's online. Um, play offline mode. There we go. All right. Um, let's. Oh, okay, you got some options. They even got the online option in the offline option area. I don't know. Training mode versus mode. Yeah, this is kind of cool. So let's just go to. What is going on? Why is it so sensitive? Let's. What the hell? What's going on? Okay, let's just use this. There we go. We'll go to versus mode. Um, we'll go against the computer. And um, yeah, let me pause this until we get into a fight. Do you know what? In fact, I want to show you guys the whole thing. This is like the character select, obviously. Um, so you've got one, two, three, four different, I guess, character groups. Um, apparently, because from what I understand, this is lots of games, put four games put together. So um, yeah, that's what you got going on here. Um, I'm going to just be the stock person. This guy, I've seen him on the cover, and I'm going to be this... That girl, she looks cool as well. Now I'm gonna choose my opponents. I'll just choose this random guy. Okay. And I guess this guy as well. And yeah, you got your, you got quite a couple of different levels there going on. It's looking very mad. Um, yeah, sorry guys, I'm just going through the options right now because obviously um, I'll do some just fighting gameplay later on. But this is really for me just to see what the options are like in the game and stuff like that. So, um. Yeah, let's go. All right, let's see. How, in fact, let me sh let's see how long it takes to load up because you know if you want to play this on the train, I guess you guys want to know what's really good. It's loaded. <laughs> Listen to the voices. Oh, so they interact with each other. Okay. Oh, okay. I guess. Whoa. Yo, this feels mad. Let's just check the buttons real quick. Um, A A A. Okay, before I do that, I need to actually check what A A A and B B B is. Okay, that's what you got going on here. A is actually Y. B is actually X. Clash is C is actually A, and D is B. Okay, mad thing. Throw is B plus C, B plus C, so it's B. Can I just shortcut this? Oh, you can shortcut the, okay. So, right, aerial dash is A and B, A and D. Isn't that like these two together? How are you supposed to press? No, no, we need to short that to something. I'm going to shortcut that to L, and we're going to shortcut throw to R2. And do we really need this one? I don't know if we need this one. Um. Crossburst, that seems like something I'll need as well. Right, let's go. Okay. Oh, that hit me. Oh, how do I grab again? Okay, so the B button changes your character. You're gonna have to forgive me guys, I'm a noob at this. But it feels really easy to do, oh. Oh, wow, the next character just came in bare quick. What is this now? Oh, that's not good. Oh. Oh, there is a Hadouken input. Oh, so if you do like a Hadouken forward, she shoots her gun. Hey, there you go. How's some of that? 
I'm sure I can do like tag moves. Let's try A. Oh, what is this? All I did was press A. All right, I guess. Yeah, that was kind of mad. That was kind of mad. I feel like it's got a lot of potential. From what I saw in the command list, that looked really simple. Um, like just press A or just like press B. But um, yeah, let's see. Let me go back into the game again. Okay, here we go again. Oh, she's, he's got, oh, that looks sick. That, it makes me, it's one of those games, kind of reminds me of Dragon Ball Fighter Z, um, where it looks like you're doing a lot. How do I grab again? Oh, it froze me. Oh, that was a grab. Oh, so you can, you can, oh crap. Okay, why is it going yellow and blue? How do I do that? I don't know what that was. Yo, shoot him. Oh, what was that? Oh, wow. Yeah, I like this. I like this. This, I think these might be, these might have to be my characters. These literally have to be my characters. It would be good if you could just do two rounds out of three. Or like, you know, best two out of one, or best what? Best two out of three, or whatever it's called. But yeah, um, yeah, it feels good. It looks good. I've already been these these couple of characters really, but um, the graphics look really nice. The frame rate looks really nice on the Switch. Um, I'm impressed. I am impressed. But yeah, guys, thanks for watching. Leave a comment in the comment section below. If you do want to see more Blaze Blue videos, if that's something that you're into, let me know in the comment section. It's not really something that I'm into, but like I played it a bit now and I, I like it. You know, it could get a bit competitive. So um, yeah, we're going to check out what's really good. Um, but like I said, thanks for watching. Subscribe, like. I'll catch you in the next one. J Jamo out.